guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Izzy. I'm a full-time content creator from Vancouver, BC. And today's video is going to be a haul video with a twist. So in this video, I'm going to be doing a Zara haul, but I'm also going to be using these pieces to demonstrate some of my spring trend predictions. So some of the things that I think are gonna be really hot this spring. Obviously this isn't a full spring haul. It's only February. Let's be real, we can't like break out the summer dresses yet, unfortunately, but this will be like a transitional spring, sorry, winter to spring haul and some kind of pieces that you can wear when you're moving from all of those heavy jackets to like, let's, we'll get to dresses eventually, but for now we're just going to stick with like the lighter layers, different shoe choices, that kind of thing. Anyways, I'm rambling now, but let's just dive right into the video. I'm gonna go through all the pieces and then I'll kind of like talk about the trends as they come up. So let's just, let's just get right in. So this first piece that I pulled here is this, it's like a ribbed long sleeve top. It's open completely at the front and then it's just got these two little like metal clips to kind of hold it together. This type of top was pretty popular through the fall and winter as well, but I do see it like coming into spring as well. Like the very like open front top. This one's more of a cropped style, but like I've also seen ones and I own some as well that are like longer style. They kind of like open wider and they're a little bit flowier, but this is more of like a cropped cardi style. I see this staying in. It looks really good with like jeans, trousers, mini skirts lots of different options for coming into spring. I'll make sure that I link all these pieces in the description below so you can shop all of them. This one I went with my true size, which is medium in most Zara tops, so that's what we're looking at with this piece. This next one, I just generally think that satin tops are gonna stay super in. All, I mean, they're, they're never not in, but I'm super into this material right now. I have lots of like cropped and long like satin tops they're good to like dress up or down they look really good with jeans for a more casual look or like black skirts like you can kind of do whatever you want with them they look good with like colored skirts too i have one like funky purple tie-dye skirt that looks really good with this style of top anyways this one's kind of cropped it's got like ties that go around the back so it's got that interesting like crisscross at the front long sleeves with buttons it's just a cute very like basic piece that looks good with like pretty much anything. I like it with a baggy style jean, which is kind of the next like trend that I'm gonna talk about a little bit. Okay, so the baggy jean trend that I was talking about, I have gotten super into, and I know they've been in for a little while, but like I really see them being a hot ticket item this spring is like baggy low rise pants, low rise jeans, that kind of thing. I've started dabbling with like low rise cargo pants, low rise jeans, speaking of cargo pants, that's what these are and these are actually like camo print which i do think is going to be in again i feel like it goes in and out every year or every few years at least but i've seen a lot of this coming out lately and i, I kind of dig it these particular pants don't fit me that great unfortunately i feel like i'm kind of like between sizes like i want them to sit really low on my hips and like be a low rise fit but they're like a little bit too like poofy on me this is the medium. I probably would have fit a small better, but then I think they would have fit me more like high rise than I wanted them. So they unfortunately didn't work out super well for me, but I like the style of them and the idea. They've got like a big belt across and two buttons and then they're long wide leg. They look really good with that silk top that I just showed. I'm super, super into this style of pant. This particular one just didn't fit me that well, but maybe it's just, it's probably just my body type. I feel like it would look really good on a lot of other people maybe with a little bit less curves if that makes sense this is a really good piece though so i definitely recommend checking this one out okay the next thing i think is going to be hot for spring this color well not this particular color necessarily but i think green in general is going to be really hot this season not just green though like that's kind of the color that i picked as an example for this i do think that green is going to be very hot but i think that like a lot of bright colors are going to be in this season like i think purple is going to be one of them and i think like magenta pink as well like some of like the bright in your face colors orange as well i'm not as big of a fan of orange but like i can vibe with some of these other colors so that's just kind of what i'm predicting but i am obsessed with this set it is a button down top they're both like the police type of material this one buttons down the front and then it's kind of open at the bottom so i like to wear it like higher on my shoulders so that it opens a little bit more if that makes sense at the bottom and then these are like a straight slash wide leg, almost kind of flared at the bottom pant. They're super flattering and so comfy. 
I love this style of set. Like this is this material and like this style of set I think is gonna be popular for this season, which like I'm so cool with that because it's so comfy. It's really chic. Like you can wear it with like a chunky heel and be super comfortable but also look chic as hell so i think that's awesome and i went with my true size in both of these pieces which is a medium in both sometimes i'm a small in zara trousers but these ones were just like oh my god they're flying around these were super comfy in the medium lots of like room to move around that kind of thing but this is like a need 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 from zara right now i am absolutely obsessed and will be wearing this all spring probably all summer too let's be real Okay, another color that has been super in all fall winter, but I think it's gonna carry through into spring. It's like at least while we're still in like this transitional phase from winter to spring is chocolate brown. It's such a good color, like this warm, like chocolatey brown. I really like these pants. They're like high-waisted trousers with pockets. They kind of are like pleated at the top a little bit. They're like full length, which I really like. And they're super flattering. They're really comfy. Trousers are always gonna be in and they're always like it's just a nice alternative to jeans They're like slightly dressier, but also like sometimes comfier too. So these are a really good pair of trousers Okay on the topic of chocolate brown. I found this stunning corset at Zara as well This is a size medium it like clasps at the back and I got it to wear with the chocolate pants I really like like full monochrome looks like that full green look and then like this full chocolate brown look I think is really cool and like chic I like the style of this top strapless like looks really good with like a slick back bun kind of vibe and yeah I bought it to wear with those trousers but like it would look good with these black jeans too or like black trousers or honestly whatever you want these tops are like really cool and like medieval vibes but like make it fashion I'm super into it I really like this piece okay next up on the topic of trousers and another kind of like hot trend that I mean, it's been in for like a little while. I still don't own a pair, but like Dickies made this trend very popular. I need to get a pair of Dickies actually. It's been on my list for a while. It's just one of those things that I need to order. It's like their workwear pants, which basically do this, which they like fold over the, you can like fold them over the top. And that's kind of the trend is to wear them like folded down. So these Zara trousers are just like already folded for you. I think they're really cool. And this style of like folding your like work pants over is gonna, be in this season these ones are kind of like a rose-ish brown color which is kind of interesting but they look good with like any neutral color or like even like a pale pink is how they had it styled on the zara website they had this with like a pink satin crop top which looked really cute actually so like i'm really into like this style of like the folding over i think it's really cute and chic and kind of like boyish but again like you can make it girly with like a cute crop top and like slick back bun kind of vibe super into it okay also carrying into spring well furs and feathers have both been kind of a hot trend for the last few months especially around like christmas and new year's with like dresses and that kind of thing i think like like faux fur and like feathers on sleeves and stuff is really chic and i think it's going to carry into this season as well during the transitional stages and i mean i think feathers are going to stay in all year because like Lots of like silk little pieces with like feather trims and stuff. I'm so into that vibe. This little cardigan is so cute. It ties at the front. It's like ribbed, stretchy, soft material. And then it's got this fur collar that I'm obsessed with. And you can actually remove it too, which is really cool. So like you can transition this piece more into like further spring past winter transitional. So I can still wear it a few months from now if I take off the fur, but I just love the fur. I think it's so cute. I'm definitely gonna be keeping this piece because I'm obsessed with it. Yeah, it's just fun. Like fur and feathers just add a little bit of extra flair that I think is really cool. So it's definitely a trend that I'm gonna be sticking with for sure. Okay, last but not least, my absolute favorite piece from this haul are these shoes. I'm obsessed. They're like super like pointy heels. Surprisingly very comfortable and like they were not expensive. They were $70. They're like a fabric material. They came in a bunch of different colors. I think they came in like orange and purple as well. Actually, speaking of all of those colors that I think are gonna be in for the season, I just I just love these for like a fun pop of color with like any outfit. Or like, I honestly like the look of wearing like two bright colors together. Like this with like bright pink, I think will be really cool. I also really like these shoes with the green set as like a full look. I think it looks amazing together. So fun, crisp 
calls me a jalapeno when I wear it, my fiance Chris. He said I look like a jalapeno, which I think is hilarious, but I'm here for it. Yeah, I honestly think these are so awesome and I'm obsessed with them. Okay, so this, these aren't part of my Zara haul. I actually couldn't get my hands on the ones that I wanted from Zara because they're currently like sold out slash backward but these are kind of similar so i just picked them up to show you guys they have two different colors of these like platform slip-on mules that are like yay high they're so cool they have like a cream yeah cream and black i really wanted both colors honestly i think like this style of platform shoe is so hot right now and it, like coming into spring and summer i think it's going to be really hot all year i actually just ordered the like slip-on versace platform heels which broke the bank, but they're so cool. I love them. I'll link them and I'll also link a couple pairs of dupes that I found. Steve Madden does a really good dupe and so does Public Desire. If you are looking to not break the bank and be a smart human being, not like me, then I would recommend getting one of the alternatives. But yeah, anyways, my point is this style of heel I think is gonna be really hot. I, I just love how it looks with like little dresses and that kind of thing for like summer going out, high ponytails. It's so the vibe and it just like makes the legs look long and lean and I'm super into it. If I haven't said that like five times in the last minute, you get the point. Okay, I could probably go on about a few more different trends that I have in mind, but I will spare you. I'm gonna cut it here. This was short and sweet and I hope it was helpful for you guys. I uh, am no expert at predicting trends, but those are some of my predictions. Feel free to leave me a comment if you would like any other links or want me to do another video like this if you like this kind of thing if you like like hearing my predictions let me know and i'll try to do more of this type of video but in the meantime thank you guys for watching and make sure you subscribe so that you don't miss any other videos and i will see you soon thanks